Complete training is available at itdvds.com. Whether you're using Windows XP or Windows Vista, the Windows 7 Upgrade Advisor is a great tool that can tell you if your computer is able to upgrade to Windows 7, and it also lets you know what issues you might run into with things like devices or applications. To use the Windows 7 Upgrade Advisor, we'll need to download it. So I'll just go ahead and open up Internet Explorer. And in Google, I'll go ahead and type in Windows 7 Upgrade Advisor. Hit enter. And the first link that will come up is Download Details Windows 7 Upgrade Advisor. This is the correct link to download the Windows 7 Upgrade Advisor. And I'll just scroll down a bit and go ahead and click Download. And I'll just save it to my desktop, or we can save it anywhere we like, just on our computer. Once it's done, I'll go ahead and close out. And I'll close out of Internet Explorer, and here it is. I'll just go ahead and double click on it to launch it. And I'll click Run. And if we don't have .NET 2.0 installed, then we're going to need to install it in order to use the Upgrade Advisor. And it lets us know it's a 22 megabyte download. Would you like us to download the file for you? I'll just go ahead and click yes. Now we'll just step through the .NET Framework 2.0 installation. And if you've already got .NET 2.0 installed, you won't see any of this. So this is just if you don't have it installed. I'll go ahead and accept the, accept the terms of the license agreement and click install. Okay, the .NET Framework's been installed, so I'll go ahead and click finish. And now we'll just step through the Windows 7 Upgrade Advisor setup. I'll go ahead and accept the license terms and click install. And the installation is complete. So I'll go ahead and click close and I'll just leave the Launch Windows 7 Upgrade Advisor checked to go ahead and launch it. And one thing I want to note is that whether you're using 32-bit uh, XP, 32-bit Vista, 64-bit XP, 64-bit uh, Vista, it's all going to use the same Windows 7 Upgrade Advisor installer. So you don't have separate installers for each version. And in the next movie, we'll go ahead and looking, look at using the Windows 7 Upgrade Advisor.